Now, they're actually doing that for uh, for-profit schools, but there are no such rules for non-profits or public colleges. And, and honestly, I think they all kind of uh, operate in a for-profit mode. It's just how they distribute their profits. Uh, for-profit colleges distribute them to shareholders, and the way that uh, non-profits and public colleges do is that they basically distribute their earnings to faculty, tenure professors, or administrative. They uh, spend their money a little different. So I think that's one way. I would consider, uh, again, reducing the uh, or capping the graduate program loans. I think that's really low-hanging uh, fruit, and that's where a lot of the, the students actually are getting in over their heads um, and increasingly I think I saw somewhere almost like half of students now graduating end up going to earn advanced degrees after that and part of the, this problem is they don't really know what they want to do they get out of college and they're like oh I don't really want to know what I want to do so I'm going to go back to school and you know earn another degree and then they get pile up fifty sixty thousand dollars more in debt and this is where like they just aren't able to repay them on the salaries that they earn after graduating.